what up it's your boy t-bird here in reaction today is uh music monday so i'm about to get into the la the latest well not the latest about to get some rhythm roulette though so no new one has came out as of yet though as i'm recording this so i went to the latest that ha i haven't recorded so i went backwards always the three years ago and the latest i haven't re recorded re reacted i bleep 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 that's all folks <laughs> but what i haven't recorded yet was uh react to yet is sango now i'm not too familiar with him though but i have my list because i'm curious though you know I'd like to check out one I'd like to check out producer i've never heard of so much so other than that that if that's let's check it out though sorry let me turn this down my back Let's turn. Let's something about that. Anyway, while for do, let's check our original late with single. Um, hopefully, unfortunately, you know, the newer ones they show the records though, but this one they may not. So let's get it. Maybe if I hear the song, I might recognize him. Oh, he's doing, and he's working with Splice. I like when he work with uh, work with like stuff so, so, like Track Live, Guitar Center, uh, Serato, and everything, you know, because you know some of us use Splice, who use some of them stuff. We can, can get some uh, ideas on how to use it, pretty good. So this is a good one though, because I have Splice and Splice Co. Splice, they have a Splice feature on my other uh, thing, but I haven't been you able to use it yet so i'm one might take advantage of it so let's this with this help i might be able to take advantage but anyway let's get it yo what's up guys sango here in my hometown seattle let's oh, check out seattle. some records and holy cow holy cow you're in for another episode of rhythm roulette so let's see what we can get mm. these songs good already Go further. Let me see. Let me check out a uh, a catalog from Sango. Those we see the guy catalog for him. But all right, he's more of a D. So he's more like more like a DJ producer though as well too from Seattle. So he's more of a DJ and producer. So what stuff he's like uh, has worked with. And it looks like most of his own stuff he done remixes. Is, is he good for like remixes and his own little moves as well too. So, uh, he's a devi dance music with with samples of jazz and soul as well too. Do some hip hop. Okay, so he's kind of all around, right? Um, he did his production project for Tanache, Bryson Tiller, Pink Panthers. Okay, Christina Aguilera, Wale, May May in Tokyo, and Spin. Okay, he got a good collection, good little um library as well too. But I mean, good little con contribution library, I should say. So, um, definitely can't wait to see what he can work with. This beat we got going right here is tough. Tradition Records. C.O. Bond McKenna. Countless Kathleen. Nick, Tom Clancy, Liam Gannon, and a few other people. Tom Clancy, okay. So, this is the Richard Pryor joint. Music from the original motion picture score, Blue Collar. Ooh. I never I never watched this movie before. But this is, in this, this is 1978. Okay. Mina Claudine Myers. I'm going to read. I like to read, so. Mm. This is 88. This is like almost 90s. Uh, we running with this one, Countless Kathleen. Let's see what she, Countless Kathleen, what, what she got. Harp. See, we're with Macklemore, I see. Oh, let's, let's see. Yeah, I knew it. Yeah, like some like some theater stuff. So he worked, he worked with Michael Moore and Ryan Lewis, so okay, that's what's up. I like her voice. I might sample that. Mm -hmm. But let's check out Blue Collar. Hmm. Okay. I kind of like that I little like group. Yeah, I like that group too, right there. Uh. Unopened? Are you, are you serious? Oh, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, hold up. Hold up. Mmm. It's the rock. This it. This yep. it. This it. It's like something like, it's the rock. <laughs> we done. Dynasty, We're baby. Done. It's like something puzzle. So today, yep. um, with the rhythm roulette beat, I'll be using Splice's very own, mm. the fantastic sounds of JD 
AKA J Dilla. Ooh. I'm real happy to have this in my hands because you know, man, being from being from Michigan, uh, grew up in Grand Rapids, Michigan, West West Michigan. That's like for those I don't know, I'm from here. This is Detroit. Mm. I'm from here. Just to have this stuff, you know, nice. that's a, tangibly in your hands, like this is the real sound. It ain't it ain't fake. We've been like downloading like fake sounds forever. I'm not saying they were fake, but like you know they were rips. So to actually have stuff from the vault is crazy. Mm. Hi hats is where you get funky. Same with the kicks, man. You can like add some kicks, make some gaps here and there that throw people off. The fantastic sounds, man. Let's get into it. <laughs> So I'm using um, Reason has this thing called. We don't know. Reason users don't know what this is called. It's either called Redrum or Red Rum, but this is what I use to chop my um, my samples. I just run it right through that. So most people start out with like a tempo for the session. I don't. I just like I would kind of react to the sample and then I figure out how fast or slow the beat is. Let's see the actual keyboard you're using. Flip that over and over. I like that one better. That's good. Never overthink your drums. Okay, I might. Actually, I'm gonna use that voice from that play. This woman's voice. kind of dope. It's like jazzy just to have it off the beard. Oh man, my wife sent me something on Messenger. <laughs> got me dying. Give me a second. I gotta send something back anyway. I'm back. Shout out to the wives as always. Well, and the mothers to be out there. Though. Another one, man. Of course, you got to do another one. You can't, you can't just do beat. one. Well, well, gaming chairs starting to wear down a little bit. A lot of people nowadays, man, they like that 140, 130, and that's what this is. 138, whatever. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. A lot of space for uh, percussion in this one too. So some loops from my uh, my splice joint. I might use that uh, the vocal again. That's the whole hi hat. I love finding like voices. And making them like instruments. I'm 
thinking for like the verses, it should be reversed and like just more like melodic and like smooth and like when the chorus comes, just chops. Yeah, cause I'm missing out on that, man. And then they come in this. I hope the turnaround is nice. And the chorus. Play the beat for my son to get the approval. He gets to doing the side to side dance, and that's like, all right, stamp. Bet. Mm -hmm. I think we got two beats. Mm -hmm. The countless Kathleen. A lot of, a lot of voices in there and stuff. So I use. I'm guessing this is her. I use her voice, just like for like. I actually ended up turning her voice into a hi hat. <laughs> that was funny. This Richard Pryor movie that he starred in. The blue collar. It was like Bad to the Bone or something like that, like mm -hmm. three times. I ended up finding a gem in here, two gems. I ended up sampling gentle piano and I like, that was cool, I like that, that was that was fun. But this one was, this was a little bit of both. It was creative and it was fun because it had, it had a lot more to offer. Um, and this was the Amina Claudine Myers joint. But I, I think I sampled at the time market. It was, uh, it was like the first song, Happiness. I think I sampled Happiness. Yo, this is saying when you're watching Mass Appeals, Rhythm Roulette. Oh, okay. And you get a sand, you get the stice on there. I might have caught that too. This was a good, ooh, I meant to, I ain't made to do Jay's Fast House again, but this was a good episode of Bomb at the Moonlight Dove for sure, though. Um, <laughs> shout out to Shade Fasashi though. Definitely can't believe I still, I'm still like feel so slow that I didn't put the two together at one. But anyway, this is a good episode of Sango. Definitely gotta check out some more stuff from Sango. And I definitely wanna check out that link too. They gotta check out the splice for the JD and him, J Dilla and himself as well too. But other than that, if you like more reaction, like, share, subscribe to my YouTube channel. It's your boy T-Bird signing off. One love.